Oh my god, I, I, I wake up in the room that looks like a tornado hit. I look at my closet and of course, of course, I go for my oversized coat because who doesn't want to look like a walking tent? I've been always told when you're in doubt, follow the crowd. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, even the dogs are wondering where everyone left. Oh, found a piece of history in this small town. OMG, I guess I see a human. G. What a heck is that? I don't always see submarines on the street, but when I do, it's in, in this town. It's, it's actually a museum. I didn't expect to end up in a submarine today, but life is full of surprises. Don't get me wrong, I love a good model ship as much as the next guy, but after an hour of staring at them, I start feeling like one of the ship. I decided to skip this grandma bingo night and go directly into the submarines. I will admit the submarine was a little tight and claustrophobic, but hey, at least I can check that off my bucket list. I was feeling a little disoriented after the submarine, but then I found this harbor. See? Check out this map and see for yourself. I'm pretty sure I've reached the end of the Earth. Or at least the end of the Netherlands. Yes, yes, yes. I'm making my way to McDonald's feeling like I'm betraying the spirit of adventure and exploration of local food, but everything, like everything, literally, like all the shops were locked. Wow, I spot some Dutch kids playing in the fountain in the middle of the winter with a water colder than my ex heart. I'm in shock. Like, isn't it enough that you already live in a cold country? Well, I'm heading back home now. So buy or not buy. Subscribe.